All right, so I want to assume that this is your first time of trying to use the Spread It Global platform. It's possible you are a user already on Spread It NG, and now you are coming over to start using Spread It Global. And so I will want to step you through how to create an order and navigate the system. It's basically the same thing, just a few additions or modifications here and there. So uh, you can see that this is the dashboard. This is my dashboard. And um, when you come in first, uh, this is basically what you are going to see. Um, sorry, my dashboard. This is exactly what you're going to see when you log into your dashboard for the very first time. Remember that to get into your dashboard, you need to create an account if you're a new user or you need to simply log in if you are an old user. If you're a new user, when you create an account, you will be sent an email and you need to click the activate account link in the email you receive and then you will be able to access your dashboard. All right, so this is you logging into the dashboard and this is procurement and shipping. Now, with time, we'll have several other services here, including here. But for now, procurement and shipping has gone live and I wanna show you how this works. So you click on procurement and shipping here or here, anyone. You click does exactly the same thing. All right, and you have start create a new order. All right, so you give your order a name, and for the purpose of this, I'm gonna call it demo order. I uh, choose a currency, either between Chinese Yuan or US dollar, depending on the currency of the store or shop or online store you want to buy from. So for the purposes of this demo, I'm gonna choose Chinese Yuan. The selection country, we have one, two, three, four, five. We'll add the rest um, soon. Depending on when you are watching this video, we would have added all the countries that we are shipping to already. But now I'm shipping to Nigeria and I'm selecting a shipping plan uh, normal, usually strongly recommended. If you are from outside Nigeria, you will have only one shipping plan, only one shipping plan. But if you are shipping to Nigeria, then you select from um, three of the shipping plans available. Shipping address, I'm gonna use uh, our corporate office address. All right. And then you click create order. This is almost the same thing. We've just added some fields in this one. Almost the same thing as the like .ng platform. Okay, having done this, you now want to start adding products. Okay, so um, you go to 1688.com. Uh, you're looking for products. Let's say you are interested in um, male wrist watches. So you can actually search directly here. It's trying to translate the page to English automatically. Remember, you are browsing on Google Chrome. Google Chrome is the recommended browser. So it is, it has, I think it has succeeded in translating this page to English. All right, so I want to search for male wristwatches or just male wristwatch. I want a wristwatch, I also want to Search for something else. So let's say you are interested in this particular wristwatch. So you click on this wristwatch. It opens the products page for the wristwatch. And the things that are important are the name of the wristwatch. Copy. Yeah, yeah, product link is this, 
this for the category category a category b category a says that this product contains liquid or battery category b says this product does not contain liquid or battery so it contains because i'm buying a wristwatch now just read this uh, how much is the unit cost in yuan i want to buy 50 pieces so this is going to be 13.5 yuan 13.5 product quantity i want to buy 50 pieces and the product weight k product weight um i can find the product weight here you come to logistics you come here um you see 0 0.1 kg 0 0.1 kg is a product weight now there is also something that we have provided here you can click on this and you watch a video that actually shows you how to find a product weight for any product and then some other things you may want to read then um, the 0 0.1 kg is the estimated product weight for this and product info is where you tell us okay, what exactly do you want this product has several colors it has black it has khaki it has brown it has green it has light green so this is where you tell us exactly what you want whether you want black um, 10 brown 10 uh, khaki now note that you must choose only the colors that are available at the supplier now so don't put any detail that is not supplied by the uh, supplier so if, if the supplier did not put that he has a white wristwatch there's no point putting white wristwatch here because it doesn't have it will, if you put white wristwatch we will decline the order so you add product all right so the product is added you can add another product we add product the same way uh that's for this for simplicity i want another wristwatch you can add any other product just for simplicity so we don't waste time with this you get another i'm gonna copy the name of this remember that i don't really need to copy this name but just can copy it and just write wristwatch wristwatch 2 or something so we copy this this here product link is uh, this product category is still this uh, product unit price is what in the price uh, I want to buy 50 still so this is going to be 18 you want 18 want to combine 50 product weight uh, the same thing I did before, you do this here 0 0.15 ah, la, la, la. 0 0.15 kg then here just whatever you want you want, just give us instruction here and then we add product That's basically so you can add as many products as you want you already know that but then remember we recommend that you restrict what you're adding to not more than 10 products in one order so that it doesn't create confusion for us in trying to fulfill your order okay so note that the total cost of this order is um, this in yuan this in dollar this in naira note that then the estimated shipping cost for this order is this yes it's 50,000 uh, remember that the total is total weight is 12 point5 kg and then we have also accommodated or made allowance for the domestic transport cost for these wrist watches so everything comes to this as the estimated shipping cost. please read this to note that this is purely an estimated shipping cost if this cost is higher than the actual cost which will be determined later at the channel office we will refund you
if the actual cost is higher than this estimated cost, you'll be required to make a balance payment. So this is an estimated cost, and you'll be required to make this payment at the time you are placing the order. All right, so we have um, all these details. So this is the grand total cost that you're paying. You really know how to do this. Just click Agree to Terms and Condition, then choose whether to pay via Paystack or make a direct bank deposit. If you are doing bank deposits, just click on this. Let's say you, you couldn't connect to Paystack. So you choose any of our bank accounts to pay into. When you pay into any of our bank accounts, then you will now need to provide the teller number or transaction receipt number or whatever here. Yeah? And then select the uh, screenshot of the transaction receipt or a PDF. So we can take JPEG, JPEG, PNG, and PDF, choose it, and then you click Submit.